Well, in the interest of saving money with all this, uh, you know, recession thing we got going here and possible depression, <laughs> got to save some fuel. Uh, you know, it's it's not so much that we have a shortage; it's just too darn expensive. That stuff is what five, six dollars a gallon pretty near here soon. So here's what we got going. Figured a golf cart would work good, but you don't want to really go with electric. The reason you don't really want to go with an electric is because at the worst possible moment, you'll run out of juice. And you'll just be stranded. And what you, you know, who's going to let you go over to their house and just plug in for two hours? Not going to happen. So, you get something here like this. This is a, an easy go golf cart. We put a windshield on it. Okay. We, we, we put a windshield on it right here. And this is, you know, just like the old Model T, the windshield will fold down. <laughs> so if it's raining and you can't see through the water, just fold the windshield down, squint. Then over here, let's take a look at the motor, man. Now this is a motor. Now that's a motor. It gets a little dusty. You know, it's got the air cleaner right here. You know, and then this is the oil. Let's see if we got oil in this thing here. Oh, look at that, it's full. It's got two spark plugs. It's a two-cylinder, and it's a four-cycle, and, and look at this constant velocity drive system over here. This works. I'll show you how it works here. Let me put it in neutral. I'll show you the gear shift. It's got, you know, top of the line. This is forward, and that's reverse, and right smack in the middle, right like that, that's neutral. <laughs> All right, so, and this is how it works. You carry your key with you. You stick it in there and you turn the key on. Get this out of the way here. <laughs> and uh, you, you, you just turn it on. And when you're right, you know when you're running low on gas, it's your gas gauge. You've got an idiot light right there. That's your gas gauge. That comes on when you're low on gas. That's your oil light. That comes on when you're low on oil. And if it gets too low, it'll just shut off and won't work. So you can't blow the motor for losing oil. And then when you want to go, you just step on the gas pedal and it starts it. Take your foot off the gas, it shuts off. Do that again. Let's do that again. All right. <laughs> That's great. Now watch this. Watch this clutch here. When you step on the gas, you can see it here, it's going to move the throttle linkage right here. See that? Okay. Now watch how this clutch arrangement works. And, and it saves gas, shuts right off like that when you take your foot off. It's not broken. Wow. That's the way it's designed. <laughs> and it's got a manual clutch for when it's cold. Look at that. We even pick up sticks. We're, we're really, really, you know, environmentally conscious here. This is the choke to help start it when it's cold. Manual choke. Simple as a bag of hammers. Simple as a box of rocks. And so now let's take it for a spin. Because there's there's your fuel tank over there. Of course, there you can see the... Oh, yeah, right, right there, here. yeah. Yeah, this is your sending unit here for your off-on switch light. A little fuel filter here. Wipe the dust off. It works. Um, yeah, it's all pretty basic. So I'm going to take it for a spin here, and flash cam Gordon's going to watch. Let's go for a ride. Right. Here we go. Now we got the windshield folded down here for you so that you can actually see where you're going. Oh, perfect.
Yeah, bigger wheels than me. <laughs> That's really nice. You need seat belts on that. Seat belts? <laughs> seat belts? <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.